Hey, my love. Can you hear me? I can't hear you. Hi guys and welcome back to your Wacko's Review, the only reviewer that has 9 babes. So if you want to be part of this group of babes, no one wants to be part of the group. Actually, like, I won't even want to be part of this group. It doesn't look hygienic at all. Please subscribe, turn on post notifications so you'll be notified when I post. Like this video, please. I beg you, like this video. Biko no no. Alright, roll intro. What? to the skinny girl in transit team i won't lie you guys got me last episode we left the episode feeling sad i even remember in my own review i literally could not make any jokes because of how sensitive the topics were and guess what you guys did in this episode you guys literally did the same thing and made the topic more serious now i can't make any joke because if i make any joke i know someone is ready to type oh my god men prince here on sensitive this is a topical issue going on in the community you better take this serious prince take this thing serious stop making ta ta i want to make jokes man that's what i do make jokes shalua being the first person we talk about because i love her yes it's my channel i do whatever i want to do i'm a big boy I sound like a child. I actually sound like a child. Shalwa in my last episode was not feeling so good because she's dating a useless boy. You know, Mohammed went to the north to do some things and we did not know what he did. All we knew was Shalewa was sad. And if Sally Baby is sad, we are all sad. I want to see crying memes everywhere. Cry. Crying memes. Memes of people crying. Is this part echoed at least? <laughs> but you trust Skinny Girl in Transit fans. They are the same people that watched 66 videos and looked at a simple image of Kanye West and they were like, hmm, 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 hmm. Wow. <laughs> you see how he put his hand? <laughs> He's definitely in the Illuminati. <laughs> accent was that. I hate that accent. I just hate it. I hate that accent. <laughs> oh my god, I can't be talking in. Children, I actually hate that accent I just used. Like, it's so irritating, man. <laughs> I'm going to use it tomorrow. I'm going to use it tomorrow because I want to irritate myself. But Mohammed had something in his chest but was never able to tell her at first because a lot was just happening in Shalewa's life. But he finally had the opportunity to tell her what happened and this was how it went. I love you so much and I'm sorry and I did not mean to do it but... It's fine. Oh, we had sex. Yep! <laughs> I said it over the years. I have said he is not meant for her. What, what did I get from subscribers? Insults, jabs. Shalua is not for you. Shalua is this for you. I got death threats from this baby. And now, who is dancing? Eh? You know what? I'm I'm actually gonna dance. I just I literally just stood up. I won. I won. I want people shouting if I not do. You guys can't see me. I'm going to put a video of me dancing just here now. This, that is me. I am Chris Brown. He comes back to beg, but she was already over him. I have never seen her look this angry before. And it actually gave me the chills. Thank you, Shalewa. This is my thumbnail. Guys, wait, guys, guys. Listen, guys. You're actually not following me on Instagram or Twitter. Please follow me. I literally have nobody and what, what accent is it? I literally have nobody on Twitter. So it now looks like I bought subscribers but I did not. So please follow me on Twitter and follow me on Instagram. My voice changed. Okay, back to the video guys. Back to the video. Hi. Tiwa and Mide are the power couple. If you've never ever been in a relationship and you see their love, you will remain single because no one we will ever be as good as this guy. But that's why it's a series, because if he was a real person, we are all in trouble. <laughs> I'm in trouble. The show started with what looked like she lost her baby, and why I said that was because of this doctor right here. He doesn't know what layman means, and he went ahead to confuse the people that know nothing about medicine. The poster is called the man out back in aspiration. What, what is that? What is, what, what is manual vacuum vaspiration? Is that even English? 
Why are we just making up words as we go, eh? It was a sad episode with us seeing Mide take all his anger on what was supposed to be his baby, Credo. Credo. Is that a is is a credo, right? Cause I I wrote credo, yeah. But thinking about it, I don't think that, that is a credo. I don't know the exact word. G G G, take it easy, take it easy. Be be a man, be a man. I hate when people say that in there. Be a man. Tiwa's mom comes visiting to ease the pain, but you know Tiwa's mom can't ease anything, and she also came with that guy. So, so you know things went south really fast. She tries begging Tiwa to eat. Tiwa said she's not interested. Then she did what every Nollywood mom will do. She poisoned her daughter. <laughs> do, do. <laughs> that's, that's what she did. She just gave them holy water that came from this guy. I don't think anywhere should drink that water. Play. I don't know where it came from. But this miscarriage hits Tiwa as we see her go through all the stages of grief. Bring out the tissue, guys. This, this is where the whole episode just becomes very sad. I did not think this episode would hit me, but it did. It's probably going to bring the baby back. I can't even comment on this side. If you watched it, you probably cried. If you did not cry, please unsubscribe. Then subscribe back, you psychopath. This episode was a roller coaster. One moment you see Woli and you want to laugh. You want to like, ha ha ha. Then boom, an emotional scene comes and you have to go back and bring your tissue. Then, then at that moment, you, you want to laugh. You're like, <laughs> Then boom again. She says this. Do you blame me? Because I blame you and I blame myself. Tiwa. Do you blame me? Please, I don't have any more tissues. I've used them all. I just want to laugh at this point. Please make me laugh. Tiwa goes back home and her mom was like, this is my husband's uh, home that I hardly see and that I have changed from season one to season two. <laughs> no, <laughs> what if you understand that joke? I, I, I doubt anybody is going to understand that joke. I'm not going to explain the joke. If you know the joke, you understand it. Uh, uh. The joke is they just changed the husband. That is all. They changed the husband twice. But the main reason Tiwa came back is because she's obviously trying her best not to have that conversation with her husband. The Greek God! They finally had that conversation that was bound to happen. Mide said he was upset with God and himself and he was also upset with a lot of things. But uh, I don't know. They just finally reconciled. I'm happy. He, he said a lot. But this is a Wako's review. Not a roman, rom, romantic review YouTube channel on YouTube. You, you guys subscribe to me. I, I do not force you. The episode was a roller coaster dealing with marital issues, and one of the biggest issues for me was the miscarriage. The episode was a crime machine. Everyone that saw it cried at this point, actually. For me, I just dropped one tear. I dropped one tear. I literally have no expectation. Wait, hey. hey. I have one. I actually have one. Shaliwa is now dating me, so I would like to see how the next episode with me will go. And I think they are actually not going to post that episode on YouTube. They are going to post it on porn. <laughs> I'm single, man. I'm single, and it's very sad. I'm making jokes. <laughs> and yeah, guys, what the hell is Vaspiration? Let's just break it down. To you and me uptown Dancing all around Till the disco ball Thank you guys for watching. This is the comment of the day. I think I'm going to start doing that comment of the day. And if you want to be part of the comment of the day, um, all you just have to do is just comment. Whatever. I don't know. Whatever you want to comment, comment. You don't have to actually be nice to me to be part of the comment of the day. And you don't actually have to be bad to me to be part of the comment of the day. I don't know how I'm putting it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was long. Was it long enough? Was it short? I don't know. I think it was long, but like the the only issue I had was that they only spoke about two characters, so that limited the amount of things I had to say. But I hope you enjoyed the video. Nicole is back, so the podcast is going to be coming back. Woo! Podcast is back, guys. 
if you thought were done were not done zero expectations please go and listen to what we posted so far because we're going to post a new one this week i'm going to put it in my community post for the people who care enough to check the question of today is what is your hidden talent for me i actually don't have a hidden talent so i know a lot of people are going to start hitting with it i don't have any hidden talent present but no something that is special about you for me the thing that's special about me is my booty <laughs> i'm joking i don't have a booty but i don't know i don't have i don't actually have a special talent but it would be fun to know if you actually have like a special talent if it is singing my own is i think making people laugh i don't think anybody's laughing at this point but i don't know, i think one is making people laugh so please if you are new here please subscribe podcast is going to be coming this week by god's grace how are you doing with the coronavirus is very scary also my anxiety is up but i'm just trying to just live my life and not let anxiety and fear take over me i'm doing all the safety precautions to be safe and i hope you are also doing the same thing um yeah thank you guys for watching please share this video with your people like if you reach this point i cherish you more than any other thing because like i'm literally saying rubbish i'm just trying to use this to just fill in space so the video will be like 10 minutes so people think i i said a lot of things but i do not i've been talking for too long i need to get out um, of your hair your, of your hair head and i'm going to be posting a vlog but it's going to be next week please follow me on my social media platforms please guys you know what i'm actually going to record a section and i'm going to put it in the video where like halfway through i'm like guys you're not following me on instagram go and follow you know i'm going to do it now thank you guys for watching have fun bye <laughs> no, no, no. Never gonna stop now.